Welcome to Easy A Homeschool Academy. <laughs> Today, we're learning about seven species of gar. Gars, often called gar pike, is an ancient family of fish. They usually have long, cylindrical bodies that are covered with an armor of scales. The scales set them apart from most other fish. These scales are so tough that humans have used them to make arrowheads, breastplate armor for battle, as well as luggage. Garfish have long jaws and sharp teeth. There are seven species of gar. They live in the warm, freshwater streams and rivers of North and Central America. They can sometimes be found in brackish, slightly salty, or stagnant water. Here is a map showing the range of garfish in North America. The dark red color indicates their distribution across the region. This family of fish are oviparous, which means they are egg layers. Babies are born six to eight days after the females lay sticky eggs on vegetation in their habitat. The eggs are toxic to other animals and humans. Garfish are carnivores. They feed on dead or live fish. They often eat crustaceans, frogs, or even insects. Adult gar are great hunters. They will often lie in wait for their prey to swim by. As stated before, in this video we will discuss the seven species of gar. They are the alligator gar, the spotted gar, the long nose gar, the Florida gar, the tropical gar, the Cuban gar, and the short nose gar. Let's think about the alligator gar. The alligator garfish is the largest species of gar and is among the largest species of freshwater fish in North America. The alligator gar gets its name because of its resemblance to the American alligator. These specialized fish can breathe in both air and water because of their primitive swim bladder. They have special scales covering their bodies, which is not like most fish. Their scales are like bony plates with sharp edges. The alligator gar's body is well protected as it is covered with this tough armor. Next, we will talk about the spotted gar. The spotted gar have long cylindrical bodies with diamond-shaped scales all over. They also have spots on their heads and fins. This special coloration and body covering helps to camouflage them in their habitat. Females are usually larger than males and as stated before, they can be found in the shallow areas of rivers and streams across North and Central America. Spotted gar are night feeders. During the day, they often lay near brush or vegetation near the shoreline. At night, they emerge looking for prey, which includes other fish, insects, and crustaceans. Long Nose Gar Long Nose Gar, as suggested by their name, have a long, rounded mouth like snout with sharp teeth. They have a very long snout that can be up to three times the length of their head. 
Their coloration is dependent on the region in which they are found. They sometimes have a brown or olive colored body that is covered in the specialized scales described before. Florida Gar Another species of gar is called the Florida Gar. They are located in the U.S. in the states of Georgia and Florida. Adults can grow to be about three feet long. The young feed on zooplankton, which are microscopic animals found in the water, and insect larvae. Adults eat fish, shrimp, and crayfish. This species of gar has irregular black spots all over its body. It has a shorter, broader snout as compared to the other gars and has one row of sharp teeth. Like other gars, the Florida gar is an ambush predator. It often lays in wait until its prey unsuspectingly swims by before attacking. Interestingly enough, during the dry season, some gar species go into estivation, which is similar to hibernation in other animals. Tropical gar The southernmost occurring garfish species is the tropical gar. They can be found in the waterways of Mexico and Costa Rica. Similar to other gars, they can be found in fresh or brackish water. Their coloration is similar to other gars, however, they have a shorter, broader snout. The tropical gar prefers slow-moving waters and is often mistaken for a floating log. They are carnivorous which means they eat other animals. Their primary source of food are cichlids. Cuban gar. The Cuban gar is on the endangered species list because of threats from humans, habitat loss, as well as predators such as the largemouth bass. The Cuban gar differs from the other species as it has a shorter snout. They have a gray coloration and armored scales. Like all the other species of this fish, they are an excellent source of food. However, their eggs can be poisonous to humans and other animals. The Cuban gar typically stays alone except when they need to spawn. Like other species, the Cuban gar is among the top predator in their habitat. Short Nose Gar the short-nosed gar, similar to other species, is a carnivorous fish. They primarily feed on smaller fish, bugs, and crustaceans. They have a brown or olive color, can grow to about 24 inches, and weigh approximately 3 pounds. Most gar fish have very long lifespans. The short-nosed gar can live up to 18 years. Several garfish are kept as pets. Experts suggest, however, if you are planning to keep them as pets, there are some key things to note. They can grow to be very large. Therefore, a very large containment tank is a must, as well as highly nutritious live feed. As a pet owner, it is important that you are providing the 
best environment possible for your pets. Much of the gar population have gone extinct or is near extinction because of habitat destruction. They were targeted for elimination by sport fishers because they were deemed a nuisance or as trash fish. As a result, their population dwindled. They are now a protected species as people have learned of their importance as part of their natural ecosystem. Conservation efforts have allowed the species to regenerate and their conservation status is now listed as least concern. I hope you enjoyed learning about the seven species of garfish today. Until next time! As always, thank you for watching. Tell us what you want to see next. Email EZA Homeschool Academy at yahoo.com. Like and share our videos. Please subscribe to our channel.